All right! The Bound Bowl Grand Prix is on! Unfortunately, though, in order to show this cutscene again, I had to go back to a poopy start. <laughs> but don't worry, I got the little checkpoint over here, so we're still good. Ish. Ish. So, yeah, let's poop down here and begin the race. Or at least try to begin the race. I don't know. Oh, there's two at the start here now. Eh, oh, thank you, thank you. So, yeah, there was three before, but... Nope, nope, not leaving. Okay, so you guys basically have the same dialogue as you did before. Yes, I am now, I guess. <laughs> so, let's go down the hatch, or four hatches that Bowser set up here. And this is an ice slide. You cannot jump off that whatsoever once you're on it, but don't worry. You can get back out using a pipe at the bottom of this slide. So, don't panic. Don't panic. The pipe, it's right along this... For front wall of well not this front wall but I mean the other one. <laughs> I was just coming here to do that but act I think there's actually something above this arch if I can get up there first <laughs> yeah is there something here now uh, maybe there's not well that's the pipe that I was saying to actually get back over to the tippy top but we don't want to do that now we've got ourselves a race yes so let's do this we need one more racer before we can start Time your bones to the moment you can make contact at the ground. Oh, it's, it's hinty for the races. Oh, I can't, I can't get the dialogue. It, the camera's too close. <laughs> you go, go faster through curves if you bound. And hmm, can't start without one more racer. Hmm, one more racer, huh? I'm in. One racer won't come out of the waiting room. What's taking so long? Hmm. Well, it looks like you gotta retrieve the missing racer. Me too. Me too. Hmm, well, let's see what we can find. Maybe we'll be able to find them over here somewhere and eh, see how things go. Hmm. Let's see his little jumping segment here. Might as well destroy the snow and Puyo Pop our way around here just for the fun of it. <laughs> just always exploring the snow as we go. And by the way, big snow wall here. It only looks like it is an impenetrable barrier, but no. There are purple coins back here. <laughs> uh, I guess I can break this all down for the fun of it. Sure, why not? It doesn't take that long. <laughs> okay, maybe it does kind of take long. This is a lot more snow than it looked. I thought I would... I guess because there's like multiple layers upon width of height. And yeah, you get what I'm saying. <laughs> ah, okay, I got it all anyway. Huh? What's going on? Huh? Hmm? You okay? Race? Uh, I don't want to. The other races are too serious. I don't stand a chance. If someone else wanted the race, they would welcome to take my place. So oh, I'm not racing. I'm not ever leaving this spot. Uh, well. Are you sure? Are you sure about that? <laughs> you can bound by pressing the B button and you get more height and speed. The better you time your landing on the ground, sort of like a triple jump in a way. So you should have this down pretty dang good. But this initial area is sort of like the practice area of your bounding, so that you can get the hang of height and landing and stuff like that. So yeah, just enjoy, enjoy your bounding here. And we're back up over here. Look at this, it's magical. <laughs> oh, 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 what, what were you doing? It's time. <laughs> bounding makes you, oh no, shoot. Um, and you key to more speed, or time your bounding perfectly. What about, what did, we, what did you say? I couldn't, okay, bounding makes you faster, but it's more difficult. You definitely want to bound, though, let me tell you. Uh, mm -mm. Go faster through curves if you bound. I think, yeah, I think this is the same dialogue we just seen. Uh, Multi-moon, oh, that's definitely new dialogue. We've got to do that. By the way, uh, what do you have to say if I were to say, leave his body? <laughs> Nothing? Nothing? Oh, I, th I think you're gonna be racing, whether you realize you are or not. <laughs> Finally! Now I can start the race! Our cake, Frost Frosted Cake, was stolen, so the prize will be a moon multi-moon. That does not, in that symbol there, it does not look like a multi-moon until it's clarified as being a multi-moon. Are you ready to race now? Yes, I am. Oh, actually, I should have canceled. It's been a, just for the sake of dialogue. It's been a while since we had a race, so we'll start with some training. 
Okay, so we got a little extra tutorial here. You can do a whole loop around the track if you'd like to to get the hang of things. And don't go in the snow itself. You just want to stay mostly on the track if you can help it. But see, yeah, see that I knocked my momentum out by landing in the snow. That is key to victory: is to stay on the track as best as you can, and also not to land yourself right in the middle of places. And also. Don't go off the track either. <laughs> I was gonna say, don't go off the track either, but oh, oh, it just automatically resets you. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> Alright. We can... Uh, can we just like... I just wanted to go back to the... Okay, fine. I was gonna say, go back to the... the dialogue that I wanted to get if I press cancel. Although, technically if I lose the race, there's probably dialogue for that as well, so... Maybe I should throw the race. <laughs> Yeah, hold on, let's see. Uh-huh. Ah. Uh, okay. Oh, that's it? You don't, there's no dialogue if you quit? Really? Ready to try again? Cancel. Uh, well, don't keep us waiting much longer. I hope I didn't miss any dialogue there. Well, well, it's just a bit of dialogue. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Snowline Circuit Class A. Begin for realsies. I don't know if you'll find shaking is better for your bounding or just pressing the B button. It's up to you. I'll be probably using the B button because I've been feeling rhythmic to button presses thanks to my rhythm game prowess lately. So here we go. We are racing for first and we are not getting that multi moon unless we get it. By the way, be careful of how you bound. Like, you don't want to always be at maximum bound if you're going to end up landing into one of those banks directly. As you've seen, I lost a lot of speed on my practice run through the track before, so yeah, just try and get yourself- oh, I hit the snow. Try and get yourself into something that's repeatable if you can help it. It, it looks crazy, but it's actually pretty manageable despite how it looks. You've got a lot of control over your actual bound angles and even your landing and stuff like that. So just relax, have a good time, and try and lap that fourth place guy. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Victory will be mine soon enough! And yes, that was the Mario Kart ending uh, checker flag sound effect. Not bad! Pretty consistent overall. Except for the second lap when I landed in the snow, but eh. It's okay. <laughs> There's obviously a bunch of shortcuts that you can use just by cutting through corners like I was doing. Probably of stuff that I didn't even think of doing before, but anyway. What a race! You were walking like a supersonic snowman! Your prize is a moon multi-moon! See, that first moon image is misleading. There should be three moons in that circle. <laughs> yeah! Gimme, 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 gimme! Actually, dialogue first. This can't be happening, you beauty bird square. Oh, you're faster than a speeding snowball! A multi-moon... My moon multi-moon sure is shiny. Can I have your autograph? Maybe? I don't think I'm this, the guy you're thinking of. <laughs> no, I am not. <laughs> right, oh, what am I stuck on there? What the... What the poop? Three cheers for the supersonic snowman! Bounty sure, well sure gives you a boost! I'm impressed and jealous. What about you? I did not. I did not. Let's get it! Woo! Oh, it pooped me out! They're like, what the heck happened to that guy? <laughs> and that's another multi moon to add to our arsenal. The Bound Bowl Grand Prix. But. As you might have seen from the outside of this place, before we actually got inside to the Icewell Shivrian's place, there's uh, quite a lot of stuff that you did not see here. <laughs> so what do you say we do a little exploration? Look, this, the sun's out. It's, it's still cold, though. <laughs> yeah, it's what you would guess, I guess. Um... Let's see, before I would do anything, I want to grab this specific Taifu. There we go. And we're going to go ahead all the way over. This, this is 
because this is the highest up Typhu. Slender, it looks like we've collected enough moon power moons. I know, I know, I know. But yeah, it, because this is the highest up Typhu that you can get, you can get to various places here that you normally could not get to on foot. Like, say, on top of this wood barricade. Hmm. That's not the thing that I was looking for. I think it's actually on top of this. Let's see if I can... Oops, no, I want to... Not, not blow. Oh, oh, painting! Oh. Uh, how do I get up there? Uh, maybe... maybe. Oh, I see, yeah, I see Cat Peach down there, but... I could have swore this was the way to get up there. I can't gain height. <laughs> uh, give me your body back. Or maybe I'm supposed to... No, that's too long of a jump for me to get from there to there. Hmm. I'll have to ponder that. <laughs> oh, okay, let's start from the beginning here. Just, just for the sake of organization. Because I'm puzzled by that at the moment in time, so... Yeah, the, oh, that's not the beginning. <laughs> that's the beginning. <laughs> well, you know, well, now you see that there's shards around here, but... Details. Yeah, okay. Explore! <laughs> For the love of Arceus, explore. Uh, maybe I should knock your knock your wind out of your sails there, just so I can pass by here. There's a planting spot for a certain seed. Where could that certain seed be? Well, let's find out. It couldn't be too far, could it? You need to open that up for the seed whenever you find the seed. But first, the timer challenge. Yeah. Gotta climb up some poles above the frigid water. Go, 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 go. Hurry, 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 hurry. Time is tight over here. Yes. Even though it dinged. Oh, that was a second one? Really? Even though it dinged, you're still good to go. Out of the water, it's chilly. Okay. Things on the body froze. That should not freeze. Okay. I guess I can go over to the moon shard area. They're all just like hanging around the middle area, so. I guess I'll maybe go from the middle outwards, not a big deal or anything like that. Oh, n technically a new enemy? This is a snow cheap cheap, but they have the same properties as a regular cheap cheap, so... I don't know if it's that new, but it's it's got a new... It's got a new name, and that was my dive move there. There we go, and they're, they are immune to the icy water, so I guess that is their, their power, I, I guess you could say. You know, shake the Joy-Con like you could with any other cheap cheap, and yeah, I get the prizes that are around, and I guess I can also, oof, I don't want to do that until I get the, eh, 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 until I get the remaining shards, just for the sake of organization, I guess. Uh, okay, let's go up and around, and downtown, and, man, you are, you are really guarding this particular one, aren't you? <laughs> oh, there's the seed. Uh, eh, I better leave that for now. <laughs> uh, where were the last couple of shards? I thought they were actually all around the middle area. Am I wrong about this? Probably. My memory has failed me in this game before. Mm -hmm. Just don't want to like begin stuff that I don't want to do. I'll get a better view from up here really quick. Uh, okay. Am I supposed to use the Typhoo to go around the... Or am I supposed to climb up the ice sculptures? Well, I don't know, glaciers? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. I guess I can grab you and get myself around here. Yes! But only up to here. <laughs> so, you cannot gain height with the Typhoos, unfortunately. Uh, okay. Well, let's... Prizes up here. <laughs> yeah, where are the rest of those shards? Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. Oh, I didn't mean to fall. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. They're just gold coins anyway. <laughs> Maybe it's somewhere on the perimeter or somewhere in the water. I don't know. Hmm. hmm. Oh, I didn't mean to hit that, but. Well, we're off! <laughs> I said I was gonna save it, but we're off anyway. Follow the path. Don't fall off of things because you've got a hill to deal with here. For this last one you might want to do a roll because it's a little bit faster, yeah. And there we go I guess. <laughs> we got a little off track on the 
moon shards, but I got the snow path dash. Uh, no, no, I don't want to go freeze things again. <laughs> I'm only okay when I'm in fish form. Uh, wasn't there actually a... No, that was where I got the, the boxes broke with the fish. Uh, let's check. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Frozen, cold, cold, nippy. Okay. <laughs> Another one of those mysterious metal blocks over there. Interesting. Interesting. They sure shine beautifully, I've got to say. Anyway, I'm gonna go hit this. <laughs> I, st I still don't want <laughs> Still don't want to do things. Penguins can fly! What the? What the? That's impossible! <laughs> anyway, I guess I can go up and do this. Is this the first timer challenge or is this the third timer challenge or is this the tenth timer challenge? I don't know. I'm all, I'm all turned around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that's right, I don't have my half. I was going to do a half jump, but I did my jump just fine. Okay, so that's the first timer challenge. And it's probably saying I should grab a fish before I get frozen here. Hat, 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 thank you. <laughs> yeah, okay, so I guess I'll go knock some boxes around just because I'm looking for stuff and I'm not leaving until I find it. It's kind of a shame that I'm having diff such difficulties with the moon shards well, because I forgot where they were but well well another timer challenge uh or is this the, just to go inside yeah it's just to go inside yeah okay not a timer challenge technically <laughs> but it is a hatless challenge uh, oh how did I miss this one before oh because I was focused on that timer challenge uh, okay yeah, anyway, so does that mean the other ones are down this way, or...? Oh yeah, I forgot these coins behind the Odyssey. Uh, hmm. Oh, I guess they really are all around this place. So they weren't around the center like I was looking before, so... It really, it would be inefficient. I'll get that rabbit, I know, I know. It would really be inefficient to just go for these and then ignore all the other stuff. Uh, yes, 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 I know, I know, I know, I gotta cut you off at the pass here. I know, I know. <laughs> Yeah. Aha! Oh no no! Oh no! Okay, gotcha. <laughs> there we go. It's caught hopping in the snow. Snow rabbit, your camouflage was no match for my sharp eyeballs. I can go fishing here. Guess which size of fish that we've got to get? <laughs> it's cold. Yes, it is. But it's still not too cold to fish. Victory already! <laughs> fishing in the glacier! Happy days! Yeah, you can clear this place out pretty quickly. I think the rest of these are just for coins and stuff. I mean, I could fish up a few. I always fish up a few. Hmm? You can't grab my line over there? Is it? Huh? I can't. Oh, oh, oh there we go. Oh, oh, hearts, I guess, too. But... Not, re not really necessary at this point. Uh, still looking for those shards. I'll just keep going around the perimeter now that I realize that they are around, or can be around the perimeter. Uh, hmm. I'm not leaving this part until I find that last shard. I find it from like a decent distance away. Hmm. Let's go back over to the Odyssey. Or actually, no. Wait, act no. Yeah, I'll go back to the Odyssey and go back around the other way. Because uh, the Odyssey, I think, is like the highest point. That's why I was aiming to go for that Taifu up here. As I said, that was the highest up Taifu. And yeah. Uh, there's purples down there. Since I'm going to go around that way anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and roll on down there. Maybe literally. <laughs> nah. Oh yeah, that hat door. It recovered the snow, I guess. Oh wait, no, this is actually a different wing. Yeah, just everything everything looks very similar because of all this whitey snow and similar platforms and stuff like that. But don't be don't be fooled, I guess. <laughs> Let's check down all the ponds if at all possible. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Come on, last shard. Where are ya? <laughs> oh, there it is. Uh, I can get that with a cheap cheap or, you know, just dive in like so. And this will work just fine. You know, it's a little bit chilly, but not that dangerous. <laughs> Look at the screen frosting up there. 
Alright, now I can get myself out of here and I take damage. Oh, nope, I didn't. <laughs> see, he's got a lot of forgiveness. And where did that moon peer? All the way on that side. I could actually, like, probably just yeah, above the ice well really quick. Now that I'm on solid land. <laughs> actually, can you warp in the water? I never really thought about that before. I would assume so. Because you can. Because there's more underwater particular areas. Moon shards in the snow. Finally! Alright. So, all that stuff that I found. Let's start with the seed, I guess. Because it's the most. I don't know, elaborate of all of them. The rest of them are just like enter a place and you're good to go. Oh shoot! My seed! No! I, no, I can't get this now. Or can I? I can't. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Yeah, you can actually carry stuff out of the water. No big deal. Now follow this over to this area here. Just drop this if you need to. If you didn't reopen that. Oh, da, da, da. I say, grab this again. And then go up here. Throw the seed in the planter. Climb up top. And head on over to the bonus. Way up in the sky! And I think it's Super Mario World Music Town. I think it is. Yes, it is! <laughs> and we're off! Use the power of the wind! And it's mostly linear, so you don't really have to worry about missing your target, especially since you can go back to little gusts of wind and stuff like that, if need be. So it's just, it's pretty straightforward overall. Use the flowers for boosts. And I'm gonna probably wait until a flower gets on down below here so I can get my boost. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. And wait for it to pop on over here. And over here. Oh, that's in the middle, actually. Uh, do I really need to get all the coin rings? I, I, I don't know. I don't think I do, actually. <laughs> oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, oh, that was close. Very close. Yeah, okay. We're good. <laughs> I don't think I actually need to grab all those, but... Alright, I think I got the right height from that. I was at the very peak of it, that's why I wasn't getting any more lift out of that. Don't worry, the, the bottom of the tornado will set you free! And make sure that your height is at max to get all of the coin rings. And then just drop straight down onto the moon. Yeah! Spinning above the clouds. Oh, I, just, I lost my spin! Well, I guess it doesn't matter at this point. <laughs> okay. Done. Good. Whew. <laughs> I guess I'll go over to that hat door behind this place here. Uh, at least I thought it was behind. Oh, there's. Our oh, I needed a Typhoon for this block. Oh, oh, I remember! You're sp to get to that painting on the other side, you're supposed to use the Typhoon to blow the block to the painting, and yeah. Oh, I can't believe I forgot about that. I mean, I was just doing that in the last part, and I was pushing blocks around with them. You know, I actually stood on top of the wood block and everything. Okay, that wasn't any, the side with the hat door anyway. This was the one with the hat door. Alright. Prepare for rocket flower time. But first, some coins. <laughs> There's a word from our sponsor, coins. Alright, so you can actually walk on water. Using the power of the flower. <laughs> Make sure you keep grabbing your stuff along the way so that you don't lose your flower power. Uh oh, that's not good. That's not good. Well, it's not bad. I mean, there's a lot of ways to recover here. And I think you can actually skip over that gap by doing a jump across it if you do go right at the edge. Could be wrong about that though. Oh no! Well, uh, well, this might not be the worst thing in the world. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, 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 I, oh, I let myself get too low. <laughs> I wanted to jump out at the very edge of the water, and then half jump across to the other side. That obviously failed. Let's try this again. <laughs> Woohoo! This time, grab more flowers, PK Gamma. They're, they're kind of helpful. You know, that, that that's kind of what they are. They're, they're here to be helpful. Yeah. See, I knew you could make that jump. <laughs> it's pretty risky to try, that, try for that jump, but... Alright. That is a shortcut. And no purple coins. Oh, that was... Oh, shoot, that was a flower. A, I need that. I need, I need to go up the second slope. Oh, actually, I'm going to have to go back down anyway, dashing over cold water. Because, yeah, when you get the moon, you automatically lose your flower power. 
So yeah, I'm gonna have to go redo this anyway. Uh, just, whoa, whoa, whoa! Camera, camera. That was almost disastrous. <laughs> okay, get yourself prepared here and grab this flower on the way up. There we go. Now use the very last bit of your boost to get up this final slope. You have just enough to get up here. Ha 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 ha! Hello. <laughs> Getting here is a good job. Well, don't you mean was a good job? You really are the something. Nope, you're purposely talking like that. <laughs> I know, I'm just joking around. Dashing above and beyond. Heck yeah. I don't think there's anything else, including purple coins or anything like that. So I guess we can just go right down into the pipe. Oh, I missed the landing. <laughs> I was going to land directly in the pipe. But sadly, I did not. Alright, with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when we clear out the rest of this area, I suppose. There's a whole bunch of other stuff that I kind of kind of left by the wayside while I was looking for those moon shards. I know, for shame. For shame.